Alrighty, guys. Welcome back in the wonderful world of Subnautica. Yesterday, you guys want to see? I made my base. Look at it. Doesn't it look absolutely beautiful? Isn't this the most beautiful base you've ever seen? Just say yes, okay? Just do me a favor. Wow, Loco, so amazing. Thanks, guys. Um, let me show you around real quick. Welcome aboard, Captain. Good. You hear that? That's respectful, guys. Take notes. I've got this beautiful thing right over here that I made as well. It's a moon pool. And I've got a sea moth over here. Which is... All systems online. Which is a little thing that I can use to travel way faster. Plus it gives me oxygen and stuff, which is also fantastic. Now, yeah, you are successfully pointing out that the base isn't currently symmetrical. So I'm gonna certainly destroy that area right over there. That's my camera room, but the camera room is not the way it needs to be, okay? I don't like it. So, I'm growing my own marble melons right now as well. For uh, multiple reasons. Main one being uh, water and food. I'm going to go ahead and actually just plant more of it. So, we'll just go ahead and uh, transfer as many of these as we can into like the third planter here too. And I'm pretty sure three planters will be more than enough, you know. I think that will give us all the food we will ever need. I just need to make sure that I plant uh, all of the seeds. I don't even think I need three, to be honest. Three is probably already overkill. Anyways, let's just make sure we fill everything in. And now we don't really need to worry too much anymore about water. This should take care of pretty much all of our problems. Which is nice. Yo, Garrett! Thank you very much. One is actually more than enough. Really? Oh. Well, maybe I should try one and see how that goes. I might make it in the center room then, or like the, the main room. Yeah, I seem to have more than enough already, huh? Okay, so now we have all three of them full, which is nice. Um, I want to go ahead and um, make an extra corridor right over here. Mm-mm. I just need quartz. Now, there's a, an area down below over here that I haven't really discovered very much yet. I think there might be some quartz hanging out in this place. I'm not sure. There's a lot of salt around here. Well, we just finished playing StarCraft 2. Got plenty of salt there. I don't really know actually what, what level you find quartz. I'm not sure. I don't know if there's like a certain depth at which you find more salt. Or sorry, more quartz than others. Probably. Uh, I installed a couple mods as well, by the way, which I think is pretty cool. Oh, you can see the scanner room. Huh. Yeah, so this is all salt. I don't need salt. Hey, a laser cutter fragment. Uh, the scanner can be used to like scan for resources from a distance. There's a lot of salt around here, guys. No quartz, though. I think quartz may be a little bit closer to the surface or something like that. Like, this is kind of deep right now. We're 167 meters. Apparently, this is where the salt lives. Yeah, I can scan for resources. What is this? Copper. Thirty seconds. Okay, we'll go to the service. Hmm. <laughs> 
It's in the caves? Maybe I should just go to the starting area then again, because there's lots of little caves around that place. Hmm. Okay, let me pick up my Seamoth then, and we'll, uh... We'll go a little bit closer to where I started. Alright, found some quartz. Yeah, quartz is everywhere, unless you're looking for it. That's one thing I found. When you're looking for something in this game, it disappears. All systems online. Emergency power only? What happened? How much do I have, though? I don't even have that much room anymore. Hmm. I left the headlights on. Yeah, I think my habitat ran out of power. We'll take care of that in in in, in a little bit. Donation accepted. Yo! Trees on the Degassi Island are better than the marble melons and quartz is available. In the safe shallows. The safe shallows? I know I can set up my biome over here. Oh, this is safe shallows right over here. Right, so we're kind of on the edge of that. Cool. Hey, thank you, Garrett, for the 20 euro tip, man. That's very generous of you. If I could see a round of hearts in the chat. That would be fantastic. Thank you, man. I was promised coral, or, or sorry, quartz around. Oh, God, no, not you again, bastard. So, wait, you're saying I should grow. I don't know what Degasi Island is, though. Is that the big boy island? I've given them my own names. You're saying they have official names? Hey, look. We found it. Okay, we'll take some damage. Ow, 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 ow. Dude, lots of quartz around here. We'll pick up the cave solver as well while we're at it. Okay, I think my backpack is about full now. Nice split slow coat. Thanks, man. I should switch to Terran. <sighs> We're going back to Prime. Loco, I'm a bit triggered that you went in a cave. Well, you're triggered very easily, Ordinances. All I did was play the game, dude. <laughs> ah, no! Oh, no! Damn it! Okay. Okay, so... I'll go ahead and drop a bunch of my stuff in one of the lockers. Warning. I think it's the scanner room, guys. Right. I need to get some glass. Everything is unpowered right now? Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna destroy the room. Oh, it's because it's nighttime, I guess, huh? Yeah, that's why. I'm getting rid of the scanner room. I might need a bio reactor room. I can make one though. Anyhow, I wanted to go ahead and make a glass tube. There we go. Oh, wait, what? Huh. And then we'll make the scanner room right next to it. There we go. I could also just build another solar panel. I could. A bioreactor is a more like long-term plan though as far as like rooms go. Um 
I mean, I could also just make another one of these things for now. You're right. Should not be a huge deal. There's also the thermal plant, but I don't know the recipe for that. We'll probably get a bio reactor going here in the near future, but I should do the trick for now. Hello, I started playing Submotica after watching you, but I, I got stuck at getting Cave Solver. Cave Solver, you gather from those Baneling things. So basically, the Baneling things they chase you, and then you loot where they came out of. Welcome aboard, Captain. I'll probably need to put down more storage, to be honest. Can I put lockers over here, too? Oh, I can put wall lockers down over there. It's not a terrible idea. What about these things? See, the problem is that it might not look great. What am I eating? I was just now eating an apple. No, that's terrible. I now have a protein bar as well. Although it's more like a nuts and like... I don't know. Yeah, that does the trick. So since I have that mold right now anyway, that allows me to mix... Oh, never mind. Doesn't do the trick. I mean, I guess it doesn't have to be symmetrical, right? We don't actually have to have it symmetrical at all. We can just put down random things in random places. Since I have the mold right now anyway, it doesn't really matter too much that we uh, have to sometimes go looking for certain items. This makes the game far more enjoyable. There you go. That's a good name for a locker. Did I just say that not symmetrical is okay? No, no, I'm just saying, you know, like, we can just make it pretty looking. We can just make it aesthetically pleasing without it making 100%, you know, symmetry. Donation accepted. Hey there, Loco. It's been a long time since I last watched your stream due to my schedule. Change a while ago. I still will watch your YouTube channels as always though, and I hope you're still doing well. Bro! Love your content as always. Demonic dumbass! That is extremely generous of you, man. Thank you so much for donating 300 euro just now. If I could see a massive round of hearts in the chat. That's exceptional. Thank you, man. Glad you still enjoy. You've been watching for years. Thank you, man. That's a lot of protein bars. I can eat protein bars for the rest of the year now, I guess. Mm. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Thank you so much, man. New subscriber detected. Also, it's already been 27 months already. Time sure flies. Thank you, man. Absolute mad lad. Resubs at the same time as well for 27 months with a tier 3 sub. Much appreciated, man. Thank you. Woo! Steaks for dinner, boys! Wait, no. Thank you, dude. Thank you. 
There's a couple of very generous people in this community. Appreciate it, guys. Seriously. Actually, I'm trying to not eat any unhealthy foods until Saturday, okay? Saturday is pizza day. But I'm trying to eat healthy foods until then. I was eating a lot of junk food last week. And maybe the week before that as well. And, uh... Basically, every day for quite some time. I was eating lots of junk, so I figured, you know what? Fuck it. We'll be a big boy and not eat anything bad until Saturday. I actually had no problems at all yesterday and, uh, and the day before. So right now is Wednesday. Um, today I'm having some sugar cravings, man. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Sugar's tasty. Loco's gonna have to three hundred dollars for steak and beer. Oh yeah, clearly. Embrace the junk food, Loco. Nah, I don't really eat that much junk food in the first place. But I was eating a little bit more of it than uh, I normally do. Oh, dude, we don't have an aquarium yet. Where are we gonna put an aquarium? I like the bench. We'll put the aquarium over here. If we can. Aquarium is big. Eh? Ooh. Ooh. Every window is an aquarium, Loco? That's a very good point, actually. <laughs> Hmm. I don't have glass for it right now. What was I going for again, guys? I don't actually remember what I was trying to get done. Um, I mean, I've got lots of things done here already. Is there, like, something that I am supposed to get... Right, I was gonna get magnetite. I don't know where to get that, though. One thing I can do now, since we have this base ready to go, is we're gonna save, first off. We're gonna explore the cave that I built this place on. So I built this place right above a cave network that I couldn't properly get to the bottom of yet. All systems online. So there's this, where is it? Right over here, there's this cave network that goes very far down. Um, that I can explore quite easily. It's just that I'm a little worried of getting stuck. No, sadly, you can't use the uh, the cave or the scanner right now for, for magnetite, as far as I could tell, anyway. I can go to 300 meters with Maybe this uh, this little Contented. ship of mine. Bro! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Absolute madman. Thank you very much. Demonic Dumas. $300 tip. Tier 3 resub. 30 gifted subs. Don't know what I've done to deserve that, but thank you, man. Have fun with the stream. Oh, yo, you're heading out now? <laughs> Alrighty. Hey, have a good one, man. I don't know if you're heading out, but it kind of, it, it seems that way. I had steak on Sunday, guys. It was very, well, it was okay, actually. It wasn't very great. It was pretty good, though. Super generous, man. You've been very busy lately. Hope it's a good kind of busy. Hey, thank you so much, man. I feel like I said that like four times or like ten times already since you got in here like ten minutes ago, but <laughs> have a good one, bro. Take care. Thanks, dude. Casually stops by, drops like 500 bucks, and then leaves. <laughs> yeah, yeah.
That doesn't happen all too often, huh? So there's a lot of quartz here in these caves as well. Is this the deepest, by the way, that we've been so far? Oh, jeez. What is attacking me? Oh, it's just a little fish. Get wrecked, dude. I don't even know if this cave is worth exploring that much. I mean, we're far down. This is the furthest down I think we've been so far, but... Ow, that was dumb. Um, it would probably help if I don't break my ship. Is this it? I feel like I've seen it all. Maybe there's another entrance somewhere, though. Yeah, is there another another area? I feel like I I I had more areas to discover earlier when I uh, dove down this cave, but maybe I'm mistaken. A lot of quartz around here, though, so I guess we can now remember if I ever need quartz, I can just dive down. Yeah, I guess there's another entrance. No, the drone went down this one, too. It feels like this is all the same cave network though, right? Like I can go down this way, but it doesn't really matter. I'm sure there's a lot of other caves, but it seems like this is all just one big area. Yeah, this game is really good. If you enjoy the sense of exploration, it's fantastic. Look, there's another cave with a similar looking entrance nearby that's way bigger. Really? Whereabouts would that be? I'm not sure. There? Wait. Along the ridges? Where? Am I an idiot? Or are you just trolling me? The entrance is very small loco, just FYI. Hmm. Yeah, I wanted to play the new one as well, but then I decided I wanted to wait until the, you know, 1.0 edition of Below Zero before I play it. The other X entrance does exist, it's harder to spot though. It's near Lifepot 6, you think? Where is that? That's lifeboat 3, lifeboat 17. I don't have a lifeboat 6, do I? It should be right above lifeboat 6. Can someone stop attacking me, please? Right above lifeboat 17? Maybe I found it, guys. No, lifeboat 17 is really far away. Oh, maybe it's this? Isn't that where I went, though, for that life pod? I don't remember. Hmm. I don't think I necessarily need to go looking for it, though. Do I have, by the way, the... Um, that's one thing I can do. Do I now have the blueprint done for the laser cutter? I do, yeah. Here's what we're gonna do, guys. We're gonna... Go back. To my, uh, to my ship. 
We'll go ahead and uh, make some some preparations here, but then we'll get the laser cutter going. And then we can hopefully use that to uh, cut through that thing in the main ship. Remember the main ship? We needed a laser cutter for that. Because otherwise I couldn't continue. Uh, laser cutter, you're gonna be hotkey 7. You can be hotkey 8. Cool. Let me also finish my, uh, my window. To the window! To, to, I'm sorry. Um... There we go! Wow, how your base is beautiful. Thanks, guys. Can I make the aquarium now, too? Because I got a lot of quartz. I think I should be fine. Aquarium is big, man. Maybe I should put it to this wall. I might have to destroy it again later, though. Because I'll probably expend the base here. But for now, aquarium can go over here. This is an aquarium inside of what is essentially an aquarium. Don't ask. Can I put my um, my egg in there? Oh, thought I could. Ah, we'll leave it. We'll leave it as it is for now. Okay, we'll drop all of that junk off. Uh, we'll throw that one away too. Oh, I think I might be able to put normal fish in it. Yeah, that could be. I don't know. Nice bug. Love that bug. We'll bring some water, and then we'll just heal ourselves all the way back up to full. Is this enough? Yep. We only need like one, dude. Yeah, we really only need like one. <laughs> Okay. Oh, never mind. We're gonna go there first. That was a lot of different things. Ooh. Sunk to the bottom of the ocean. That's okay. Can I repair this thing? Oh, yeah, I can. Nice. Okay, so we just got the life pod right over there. That's what we're gonna be doing. I feel like it's been nighttime for like 20 minutes now. Am I crazy? Nah, it's at a depth of 250 meters, but it's 800 meters away. I can go to uh, 300. Man. Isn't the sense of exploration in this game wonderful? Fucking love that. Really cool. Maybe this whole biome is just dark. Yeah. It's because it's so far down. Sorry, fish. I love this part of the game. What's this now? Ooh, that's a big egg. I prefer the Big Mac. <laughs> it's not Thor's, okay? I mean the McDonald's kind. Mm, I don't think we want to be above that. I think we're good. What in the world are you? 
We're chill, right? I don't know if we're chill. Yeah, he's a shocky boy. There's a whole bunch of these guys around here. Detecting volcanic activity and several unusual electromagnetic signatures in the region. Exercise caution when diving deeper. Oh, jeez. These guys attack my ship? Mother. Lovers. A common bulb bush. Ah, oh, shit. I didn't bring a battery. Okay. I don't need to get the battery recharger. Repulsion cannon. I'm uh, not really a doctor. I know that's what my ID says, but I never have been. Cheated the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these oh, days read right. diagnoses off of computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what good is it when I'm not connected to the main network? I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my hands. That's not good. self scan and it tells me I've got skin irritation. The only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. What the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I think I'm actually going to die down here. So is he saying that you can be a doctor by knowing how to use WebMD? Pretty sure that's what he's saying. That's how you become a doctor. Smart. I've googled my symptoms many times. Cannot recommend. 3 out of 10. I suggest we go further. Like we explore a little bit further. Loco, my girlfriend worked for M WebMD. I made these jokes all the time. Nice. Yeah, WebMD is something. It's the website you get to whenever you Google any symptoms. It's like you have a headache, right? Could be anything from dehydration, migraines, brain tumor. It's like, okay, one of these is not like the other. Um, They all suck, but like... My brain is really good at making it immediately the worst of the possibilities. Now, technically speaking, obviously, it's accurate. Like, if you were to, you know, be a doctor, I guess it is one of the possibilities. But, yeah. Don't think it's very smart as a regular person to... Just go ahead and do that. Let's go see a doctor, man. A vending machine? Oh, baby. Nice. Have a good one, sissy. Yeah, there certainly is use for WebMD. You can get many uh, useful bits of info, but... It's also a bit of a gamble. Modification station! Hell yeah! Oh, that's what we need! I need three of those fuckers, though. Man, I really need a bunch of batteries. 
I don't like these guys. Okay, we're gonna save again. I think there might be more there, guys. Oh yeah, look. This is why we have um, our laser cutter. So the laser cutter is what I used, or what I wanted to use to go to the main area, the main boat. Are you chill? I don't think he's doing alright, guys. Oh, new battery. Oh, yeah. Modification stations. That's hot. Okay, I think that's it. So we got ourselves the modification station now completely done. Which is awesome, because I can use that to um, upgrade my flippers, as well as my oxygen tank. Wait, I missed something? There was another door maybe? Oh jeez. Okay, fine, we'll go check once more. There's always more? Man, I want to get out of here. Thanks for reminding me, though. Man, there's a lot of things around here, actually. Alien containment. So that's where we throw in the eggs, huh? Oh, there's another door, dude. Wow. Wait, no, this is literally a door to the... Uh place that I was already at. I think that's about it. I don't like Mr. Sparklefish very much. Wait, there's an upgrade console thing? Where? Oh, is that new subscriber detected? What's this? Another modification station? Okay. Oh, I don't like this place. So you're saying it's one of those things that I can put in one of my ships? One of those things? I don't know where. Hmm. Yo, thank you, Clash, for the resub. Welcome aboard, Captain. I went past it like five times. Yeah, but I don't know where. Hmm. Wait, it's inside? This thing? There's nothing in this thing. No, there's nothing, dude. I didn't go buy that. I scanned that thing, if I'm not mistaken. There's nothing in there. No, I can't take the modules out. Hmm. 
No, I think I got everything here. Pretty sure I got everything. Okay, no worries, no worries. Thanks for giving me the heads up that the option might be there. I don't think there's a module there. Okay, all right. Time to get out of here. Or, I mean, now we're here anyway. We can explore a little further, maybe. I did save, so I can always go back, right? It's all good. Okay. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. Okay, that's not great. My ship can't go any deeper than this. I have a module that allows me to go 100 meters below where uh, I'm at right now. Like, this is the ex absolute most I can go. Oh, another time capsule. Nice. These are left by other players. Free some space to pick up Sea Glide? Wait, what? It dropped me a sea glide? Someone left me a sea glide? I just don't know where, guys. Plus, there's leviathans around here. Um, if it left me a sea glide though, is there any reason why I would want to have it? I don't need it, right? Yeah. I was gonna say, like, I don't think there's any reason why I would want that. Pretty sure that noise we're hearing is, a. Uh A reaper. I guess we're so far down right now that light never reaches this. Oh, I didn't read the message here, right. Time capsule. Here's to a goodbye. I've left you, stranger. Something that I hold dearest to me. My sea glide. I dropped it. From the beginning to the end, this simple yet amazing piece of technology carried my body weight through thin and thick from five meters below the surface to 1,700 meters below. I can never imagine what I would do without it. Please take good care of it, as it did of me. Sincerely, Nick. Um, Nick. Your time capsule? I don't... I, I, I don't know. I, I got so many items. The nutrient bar and stuff, but... I'm afraid your sea glide... You know... Was a very good thing at gliding. It, it glided down into the depths. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh, even if he had a better battery in his Sieg Light, it would still not work. They've removed those OP items. I gave it a burial at sea. I did, yes. He should be grateful. Welcome aboard, Captain. Um, which one is my repair tool? Ah. Nope. Welcome aboard, Captain. What is this? Coming back for transporting personal items. Why do I have a carry-all? What is the point of that thing? Hey, I do have the sea glide! The sea glide was inside of the bag! That's why I couldn't find it, man. All right, I suggest we uh, we store it for him. You know what? I'll put it in the backpack. Yeah, we'll put it in the backpack. He seemed like a great guy. Nick, I will... Ah, uh... oh, here we go, Nick. Look, look how casual this is. Wait, no! Damn it, you were... S Stop sitting! Stand up! We we're supposed to put down the bag right over there, dude. Oh, yeah, look how casual that is. That's decoration, guys. Very... C no, dang it. Oh, yeah. Alright, we'll put a Sieg Light in the thing. There you go, Nick. That one's for you. Look at how aesthetic. This will definitely improve my morale. I wish I wish I had like a battery charger. So this one's almost empty. This one has to have a new one. This one was almost empty. Yeah, I need to make more batteries. I can't have my battery recharger yet, which I would love to have, but at this point I just can't. What's up, Mikey? Let go sit on the bag. I'm sitting inside of the bag. Amazing. I leave my gym bag everywhere. No, it's aesthetic, ma! Jeez. I've got a lot of batteries. Just laying around in different places. If I get a battery charger at some point, it's gonna be exciting. I will get one at some point. I guess just not yet. Anyhow, um... I also made a beacon, yeah, not that far away, for the laser cutter. Because I needed a laser cutter for that place too, so let's make sure that we can... Oh. Huh? <laughs> Alright then. Uh, I made a, um... There it is. I made a laser cutter beacon. Just because there was something that I could cut with a laser. Hey, Clash, did I thank you, by the way, for your sub? I don't remember. I think I did. I did just jump through a, a bunch of obstacles, yes. Hey, well, thank you very much, Clash. <laughs> Oh. Picture frame. Nice. Now I can make a picture of me and all my friends. I don't have any friends. Huh? This is the laser cutter, right? 
Yeah, why does it not work? Wait, am I on the wrong door? I thought I needed to, oh, it's this one. Wait. A little aggressive. Yeah, this one. Okay. It's just random ominous music. Weight, high capacity tank. Nice. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. I already have that now. Is the game hard? Nah, it's not really hard. I mean, it's not meant to be super complicated or difficult or whatever, I don't think. It's a game that's meant for... Get this. Fun. Ugh. Oh, wow. Battery charger? Oh, yeah. Can I please have the battery charger? Oh yeah, baby! I don't have that much oxygen anymore. I think I'm gonna go out real quick just because... I'm probably gonna die. If I don't. Uh... We go through here. Okay. Yeah, battery charger is super helpful because I've got like 17 different batteries. Is it worth $30 Canadian? I mean, it's hard to say if a game is worth it, right? Like, I can't look in your wallet, but... Um, I have certainly gotten uh, my money's worth for this game. If you do a full playthrough of this, it's probably gonna take you at least 25 hours, maybe 30. I think my first playthrough was like 35. But I play pretty slowly. Because I'm in no rush. Yeah, so this is like my second playthrough of the game and I'm still having a blast, right? So, for what it's worth, I think it's fun. I like how there's a laser cutter fragment in a room that you can only access after having a laser fragment. But I mean, it depends, right? What you can always go ahead and do instead is just watch my playthrough. And then you never have to actually play it yourself. You can just, you know, watch me play instead. And then you can spend the 30 Canadian on like a half year, half, half year long sub, you know? <clears throat> nah, I'm just kidding. I would recommend buying this game. It's great. There was a PDA. Was there really? Bro, I feel like I forget so many things. There was a PDA. Oh, damn it. Where?
Not over here. Not over here either. In the corner next to the entrance? Where? There's nothing, man. There's a laser cutter. But we already have that. Pretty sure we've found everything here, guys. Almost two years of sub can't believe it. Love the content, Loco. Keep up the amazing work. Thank you, Skittles. Welcome back. Yeah, the laser cutter did look a little bit like a PDA. I'll give you that. Maybe there was a poster. It's okay, I got my prawn suit poster. That's all we need. And thank you, Skittles. 20 months. Okay, so Modification station Battery charger Those things are very helpful uh, Don't know where we're gonna be putting it I don't really know what they look like This is my main area, right? I guess we don't want to put it over here Maybe I can tuck it in the corner though Oh yeah, I can just stick this to a wall We'll stick this one over here, actually. This is my battery charger. There we go. Um, I have a whole bunch of empty batteries. I don't know how many you can throw in there, actually. Four? I mean, I guess we don't need all my batteries anymore, but... Batteries to charge the battery charger. <laughs> yeah, that would kind of suck. Alright. Yeah, so they're charging. Fantastic. Uh, modification station. Advanced fabricator for modification of survival equipment. Honestly, we don't really need to put it in any specific location. We can just put it in one of these rooms. I can make another battery charger, yeah, but I don't think we need to. I'll build the modification station in the moon pool. We'll put it over here, around the corner. Or will we? New subscriber detected. Let's go down, Jay. Thank you so much. 